Scooter Co. video update number three. Um, you guys just got to watch some some riding that we've been up to lately. Haven't released the video update in a couple weeks just because, as you've seen, there's a lot of snow everywhere. So, so shitty out. Can't do anything. Yeah, it's pretty beat, but everywhere we go to ride, snow everywhere. It's like, oh, let's go to this spot. Nope. Snow. Yeah. So, all you guys out in Cali, lucky. Uh, I'm checking the weather out there. It's fucking nice. <laughs> but, so as you guys know, you've seen on the website and on Inside Scooters. Inside Scooters, yeah. This prototype right here. Yes. Can you see that? Yep. Show the bottom of that Oh, yep. Okay. Mm. Something like that. No bolt. Just use back axle. So, for all you guys asking questions and stuff, and whatever, the cutout is not a cheese grater. It doesn't even really touch it there. I've been riding it for a couple weeks now. My wheel's fine. It's just as worn down as it has been for months. I'll show you how this works now. So, taking my back wheel off. All it does is it slides into the dropouts and you got the spacers. When you tighten the axle, you know the spacers tighten against the wheel and the dropouts. And this is just in between it, so it tightens that too. As my wheel falls apart. So this is what that is. You've seen the pictures of it like that. All right? So. See how that looks? And then he's got the spacers. I mean, I'm gonna have like nice ones made. No real need for it, but I just use razor ones for that and uh, trimmed them down. So, I put this together. Got your scooter right here. Take this, it goes like that. Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> and then you just put your wheel on like normal. So. I never got to see this yet. Yeah. And then. Uh, yeah, there's no reason to have like another bolt in there for where the brake is. Because like even without the back axle, like look, I can press down on it and it does the brakey action. I mean, obviously since it's not tightened down, it's got a little wiggle. But once you tighten the axle, nah. So that's how that works, just so you guys know. Woo! <laughs> and also, the questions about the pegs. Gonna be having prototypes of those at my house by either the end of this week or the beginning of next week. So expect to see a post on those too. And we'll be riding those real soon, so check it out. Yeah, can't really do a drop test with the brake because Eric's scooter's not the... Oh, uh, yeah. Well, here's a drop test. Well, I can't drop it in Jason's room. There's people downstairs, but... Drop test of my scooter without the brake. Oh, like... 
<laughs> yeah. So that's uh that's not really gonna help you to see how this brake is. It's 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 a solid brake though. My scooter, not so solid. <laughs> so. Oh my god! Mama Griffiths is hooking it up! This is what Mama Dukes does. She makes, <laughs> she makes us pizza. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes, dude. Yes. And you can't have any. Uh, no, we'll uh, no, no. catch you guys later. Is there anything else? Um, We will get you a drop test, though. With someone else's scooter. Yeah. Show us solid John Ray's a scooter. Most solid scooter ever. Or someone who's got a Razor right now. Yeah. But, um, we're, we're about gonna, to eat some pizza. We're going to eat this pizza. And we'll render this video and get it up to you tonight. Oh, yeah. Jason's uh, editing this video right now. So... See us on uh, Inside Scooters probably within the next week or so. Yep. And with that, shout out to Steve T. And shout out to all the guys that ride in this video and all the guys we ride with every day. And Make this possible. Shout out to everyone else who helps out with the whole company and everyone else who's contributed to the scooter community. Holla.